So I want to show you how to create something like this. This is a, a, a website I created for a client in Kenya, in Nairobi here. And uh, she's based in uh, Lovington and uh, she does, uh, she sells and hires graduation gowns and also runs an um, education center. So we're going to see how we can create something like this. So people can come to this website and hire and also buy gowns. These are all for hire. This is this one is for sale. And uh, bachelor's gown for sale. Yeah, so we want to know how to create something like this. So the first thing is uh, logging into your, your control panel so that we can install. I'm going to show you I'm going to show you how to create something like this using WordPress. WordPress is the easiest content management system to use to create your website. And uh, if you really want to go online, you should consider uh, WordPress because it's the easiest to use. If you can use Microsoft Word, you can use uh, WordPress. So let's get started. So the first thing is to log into your cPanel. I'm going to use my domain. I'm going to use my domain webdesigntools.xyz. I I'd shown you I talked about this uh, in my last video. Uh the video about uh, integrating your your webmail, your website email with uh, Outlook. Yes. Yeah, so the first thing is to log into your cPanel and my cPanel is right here. I'm going to log in. And then I'm going to look for WordPress. WordPress, I'm going to scroll down. It's here. WordPress Manager by Softaculous. Or you can as well, you can as well go here, Softaculous App Installer. You can also go down to Scripts where you will see WordPress. Just click on it and it takes you to Softaculous. And then we are going to install now. Let me scale down a little bit so we can see everything. Yeah, so it's right here. Choose installation uh, URL. I want to to install WordPress in a uh, subdirectory of this domain. So the domain is webdesigntools.xyz. I'm going to install under uh, something like um, online shop. Online shop. Yeah, something like that. And then on site name here, we're going to write the name of the company, uh, Monaisha Fashions. Fashions. What am I doing? Monaisha Fashions, Nairobi. Uh, we can say online, or we can say fashion shop. Fashion shop. Fashion uh, shop in. Uh, Fashion Shop in Nairobi, and then we'll come here and choose the email that we're going to use, uh, the admin username. We can use an email there, or you can just use a, um, a username. Let me say, or well, let's just use this as a, as a password here, and then this one, let's make it online show Moana. This is going to be our username use something complicated so people cannot you know guess the email we can use that one admin at webdesigntools.xyz yeah you can use that as the admin email or you can use your gmail if you want but these are very important the username and the password very important after you do that you can uh, and check all this we don't need them we will use our tools the ones that we will install and then that is pretty it so we are installing under a subdirectory and then the site name is Monaisha fashions and then there's a fashion shop in Nairobi and then the admin username is online shop can even say shop online shop Moana and then uh, the admin password is that one I hope I will remember this 
you can copy paste it somewhere and then the email is this and then you say install imagine we're going to create a simple online shop right away yeah and that is it so the website is going to be webdesigntools.xyz that's the domain yeah or you can buy something like webdesigntools.com stroke online shop that is going to be our our website link and then the administrative URL where you can log in and start creating your shop is this one webdesigntools.xyz stroke online shop stroke wordpress admin wp admin stands for wordpress admin so let's go there and log in it is going to log log us in automatically but if we log out we will use the details that we we put on the other side when we were installing wordpress the password remember was this one online show at hashtag 2030 the username was uh, online shop moana that is a, the, the username that we alternatively we can use the email admin at i'm gonna save this admin at web design tools dot xyz the email that we set there as the admin email was admin at uh, web design tools dot xyz still works all right now that we're here we want to start let's let's first uh, see how our website looks like you, you just come here and then say open link in a new tab let me repeat you hover over the name of the business here that we set when we were installing WordPress and then visit site this is how it looks like all right yeah so of course we need our website to look good like this one uh, and other online shops that you know around yeah like Jumia and all that but now you know with our website with our WordPress installed here it's uh, it looks blank because there is not really much that has been done to to this website so that's what we are going to do yeah we're going to start installing our online shop tool that we're going to use so that we can have a shop so our first plugin you, you hover over plugins and then you say add new plugin the plugin that we're going to use to go online to take our business or our yeah to create our online shop is WooCommerce yeah it's called WooCommerce it's already here so you just say install now and you can see that 8 million plus people have installed this plugin on their websites which means it's a very very good uh, plugin all right so after installing it will tell you to activate and then after activating it will take you to the setup wizard where you will be asked to put some information about your store you just say you can say set up my store and uh, fill in all this I'm just starting my business or I'm setting up a store for a client if you're a web designer I'm already selling if you're already selling just say I'm already selling are you selling online no I am selling offline continue give your store a name on Asia fashions and then which industry is your business in clothing and accessories because it's fashions and then uh, where is your store located put your country there and then say continue and then uh, get a boost with our free features uh, 
you can uncheck this showcase your products with pin interest or other Pinterest drive sales with Google for WooCommerce those two can remain you can install them then woo let's get your features ready it's gonna set up your store so be patient for a few so we are ready cooking with gas it's still loading and then import your products get paid collect sales tax launch your store this is good so let's uh, let's uh, add our first product let's go online and search for uh, jeans for sale images I just need a picture I just need a picture oh my god this is good but always use uh, pictures that don't belong to other people to avoid copyright issues so this website called uh, Pexels is very good for getting free pictures and then you can say jeans yeah even this one let's take this so you come here and choose the size you want let me say 1280 by that's a little bit big this one 640 times 966 is good and then um, let's call it jeans and then let's go to our WordPress and come here to WooCommerce uh, down here we can see products so products add new product let's say jeans and then let's add some uh, text here and then say la something like uh, create uh, for me uh, content for jeans uh, product page page uh, you can say something like our jeans are da 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 knows what knows what it wants our jeans are designed for those who value both style and comfort blah 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 you can, we can copy this and bring it to our wordpress here so this uh this product description area is for a detailed description of the product but you can also have an appetizer text for the the short description area here so we can come to this and say okay premium quality jeans da 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 da, da, da. so I, I can say our jeans are designed da, da. so we can take this up to here so that why choose our jeans can go to the longer description all right and then the regular price this is where you put your price and you can say something like 1000 let's say you you are selling at 1500 and you want to give them a bonus of uh, 500 shillings or you can say 999 yeah so that is it the name here the long description here the short description here this is just a sample for now and then you can you can come here and say set product image and then we can go to our downloaded product and then uh, pull it like that drag it and drop it here and then say set product image so we have our product image there and then say publish so that is our first product we can come here to the permalink this is the link to the product and see how it looks like whoa look at that this is beautiful so this is the short description here the price from 1500 to 999 and then uh, look at that this is now the long description very simple that is how you take your 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 business 
online and uh, that's how you create your 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 online shop it's very simple so if you like this or need more consultancy you can write uh, to me in the comment section and tell me which part you didn't understand or if you need a consultancy on uh, where to buy your domain what kind of domain to buy and stuff like that hit me up in the comment section and I will reach you out uh, to talk more about that but for now that is it that is how you take your business uh, online and that's how you make an online shop for your business thank you so much for watching this video and uh, I will see you in the next one but remember if you've watched this far that means you're interested in videos like this so please subscribe like comment and share this video so that many people can watch it and enjoy uh, and also take their business to their internet and create online shops for their businesses so thank you so much for watching and i will see you in the next one bye bye my name is elkana bye bye